What's going on, baby? My name is Elephants. Welcome back to yet another reaction. And today we're doing something a little different today. Today we're checking out some more Poppy Playtime, but it was uploaded by Mob Entertainment themselves. It's Poppy Playtime, the story so far, chapter one. It's essentially a retelling of the events from the very first chapter. And the reason why I'm reacting to this is I'm wondering if they have a little bit more information regarding some, you know, extra lore. Because before Chapter 3 came out, they were making the, the um, VHS videos that basically show, brought up more details and more uh, elements of the story that wasn't presented in the game. And I did check those out, so if you guys want to check them out, go check out my uh, other Poply Playtime reaction videos. Because I have never played the game myself, but I have been watching it since basically... Uh, the events of chapter one and two came out. But that being said, we're going to get right into this because I'm hoping there's a little bit of extra lore that will be hidden at the end of this. Three, two, one, boom. Playtime co security log zero, one, two, five. Entry to front lobby reached by unknown intruder. 2005. A tale like this always starts simple a mystery about a toy factory whose staff all vanished a decade prior. Well, almost all. It was dusk when the intruder broke into the factory. Its main lobby provided a warm welcome for all. But these days, it is an old forgotten thing. It didn't take our lone intruder long before the first voice of the factory rose over the silence. Late the air. It's not too late to turn around. I just Oh, there was an image on that VHS? I don't remember there being important. an image. They ignored the warning, of course. Stealing a Playtime Co. grab pack, once used by staff and invented by the elusive company founder, Elliot Ludwig. Elliot. I don't know why I couldn't remember if his name was Edwin, Elliot, or Eddie. I don't know. I just it was pondering that in my head before I started this reaction. The Just next creation our guest encountered was none other than playtime mascot Huggy Wuggy. He loomed over the foyer with a wide, vacant smile. Weaker people would have laughed at that point. And yet, this intruder progressed down, kicking up pieces of the distant past in their descent. A pretty great feeling, too. <laughs> And this is where the fun began. Our intruder stirred one of the factory's security measures, and he performed exactly as he was designed. Yeah. Our intruder scrambled through ventilation ducts with Huggy not far behind. The ventilation in this place has always been a maze. It's impressive this intruder made it through at all. Eventually, they made their way into an open warehouse, narrowly avoiding a collapsing catwalk that sent our dear Huggy plummeting into the depths below. Jeez. I forgot they he hit his head three times. Catwalks for quite some time. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not, end of... Eventually, they moved on into a room the public was never meant to see. It wasn't a factory floor or a corporate office. This place was different. And yet, not even a hint of the missing staff. At right. the end of a long hall, there was a room. And inside that room, there was a glass case. Inside that glass case, a doll. Poppy. And we shall see what comes of it. Wait. Won't we? Poppy Playtime is on the Nintendo Switch? I didn't know that. That is completely new to me. The fact that Poppy Playtime is playable on the Switch. I'll have to ask my brother if he can confirm that. I'll talk to him tomorrow. I'll ask him if he could look up play, Poppy Playtime on his Nintendo Switch. Because I don't have one. But I do plan on getting one. Um, okay, so... Getting straight into the... Aftermath of this. There wasn't anything new 
added to this video. It was essentially just a recap of chapter one itself. There was it wasn't any hidden secret that I could find. Um, little disappointing, of course, but it is an interesting step that they took to actually recount the events of the first chapter. And it's likely that they're going to do it with chapter two as well, because chapter two, one and two came out several years, like a couple of years ago at this point. And chapter three only came out what we're in July right now. It came out at the end of January. And that's when I did my reactions to chapter three and everything else afterwards. Um, so I guess now we're gonna have to wait until the next upload from Mob Entertainment and the next news we get about Chapter 4. So, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's reaction video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye!